How you doing, Leo? So this will be another who's coming towards you love reading. Now, I have already shuff, started shuffling the cards, and two cards already popped out. The reason why I left them there because people be acting weird in the comment section about me not showing the cards at the beginning. So, the only reason why I do put the cards down at the beginning is so that I won't waste time, you know what I'm saying, shuffling while y'all watching. You see what I'm saying? I just feel like it just don't make no sense to sit here and, you know, shuffle during the video. During the whole video when y'all gonna skip through anyways. But yeah, I got two cards that popped out. The first card I got is Unexpected Lover. So, y'all got an Unexpected Lover popping up, Leo. That's coming towards you. And then we got Side Piece, Sneaky Link, Reverse. So, maybe this is somebody from the recent past that could be coming back. And maybe they left you for a side, a side, link, a side piece or a Sneaky Link. And they may have dumped that person. But we gonna see. We definitely going to see clear intuitive messages, please, for Leo. Who's coming towards Leo? Who knows? What's going on? What's, what's going on? When they come through, what's going to happen? What's going on? We need to know. Some of y'all may be guarded when that person come back. I've seen that cautious card, but it didn't pop out. Clear intuitive messages. Who's coming towards Leo and why? And what is the story? We need to know. This. We need to know the business. We need to know the scoop spirit. Clear intuitive messages. Okay, we got hard closed. Didn't I just say that somebody is gonna be guarded? I mean, completely, like guarded. Like, not like some of y'all could be afraid to open up when this person come back. Clear intuitive messages. Other way around. Clear intuitive messages, please, from Leo. Okay. That's too many. This one will come back. This one okay, has come out. Okay, we got gaslighting. We got lonely. We got confused. And we got love affair. Who's coming towards Leo? What else is going to happen in this story? Karmic love. Okay, I might need to clarify i don't know yet we're gonna see but you got you definitely got an unexpected lover i think i am going to clarify this is somebody that it could be somebody new some of y'all but i'm not getting that most of y'all this is somebody you already know this is definitely somebody you already know leo that's coming through see that's why i don't like really shuffling on camera because it takes too damn long you see what i'm saying i don't even like shuffling on camera but you know like People be acting weird as hell. So you gotta like do it anyway. You got the Empress. So some of y'all, this could be somebody you have kids with. The unexpected lover, and then we got the Empress. Some of you guys could be your baby mom or your baby dad. Or if you want to say it the other way around, kids father or kids mother. You know, don't same thing. But like I said, this is somebody you have children with. Some of you guys could be currently pregnant by this person, Leo. This person that's coming towards you. But this person does want a new start. This, I feel like your, if your person may have walked away from you, Leo, for a side piece or a sneaky link, somebody that they was dealing with on a sexual base level, they dumped that person. They got rid of that person. But we definitely going to clarify. I think I'm just going to go ahead and go down the line and clarify the first row. So I ain't got to keep shuffling until I get to the second row. What else do we got? This one to pop out so bad. I ain't catch it. But, uh, clear intuitive messages for the story spirit that goes with this story. We need all the messages that goes exactly with this story. We need all the messages that go with this story. All right, so yeah, they definitely did let that other per person behind because we got the full reversed. They left, the, they left that side piece or that sneaky link. They dumped that person. Or that sneaky link or side piece dumped their ass. But I am seeing that somebody left the other person. They left. Whether it was them or whether it was the third party. But when this person comes toward you, Leo, I feel like some of y'all could be dealing with somebody who is very manipulative. I ain't even going to lie. We got heart closed, but it's reversed. Some of y'all, this person could be lying, or you could be figuring out this person is lying about leaving the other person behind. But like I said, some of y'all, when this person come back, 
y'all probably not even going to be emotionally available for this person. Maybe you, over the period of time, you have, you know, lost feelings for this person, you know, and I just felt like it's because they left you. Like I said, they left you for somebody else, but I am seeing that it is showing me that they did leave the other person. But some of y'all, like I said, some of y'all think, going to think that this person is lying because they lied so much and they left you. You know, I wouldn't believe believe they asked either. But at the same time, like, y'all going to be very guarded and closed off when this person come back. Yeah, because y'all feel like this person gaslighted you so much to the point where, you know what I'm saying? Like, how can you trust them when they come back? Because of the, because of the shit that they put you through, yo. You know, but I am seeing that this person is um, trying to make a change. They... They see that they basically have a different perspective when it comes to you and y'all relationship. Like, but like I said, some of y'all's person could be gaslighting you. Some of y'all's person could be trying to make it seem like it was your fault that they left. I am clearly seeing that. Even though it's like they want to come back, but they it's like they're not even trying to hold accountability for what they did. You see what I'm saying? And that's fucked up because, like I said, they left you for somebody else. And um, or this could be the other way around, Leo. Okay, but I am seeing that. This person is, like, still not holding accountability for what they have done. Because they gaslighting you with that hangman in that gaslighting car in reverse. I feel like they trying to make it seem like you was the reason why they left. Yeah, but I feel like this person only wants to come back because they alone. They lonely. With this two of wands right here, reverse. Yeah, that other person left them. They left them. But like I said, Leo, y'all going to be confused when this person come back. Y'all really going to be in y'all head. It's like y'all, most of y'all have already, like I said, over time, <clears throat> excuse me, over time, like, fell out of love with this person. And then when this person come back, you're just going to be very guarded. And you're not going to be too sure if you want to take them back because they are your baby mom or baby dad. But at the same time, this person is not trying to hold accountability for what they have done to you. That's the main part. They're not trying to hold accountability. And it's like, it's leaving you confused. Or whether you should take this person back or not. Clear it to the messages. Okay, this came out first. The creator reversed. Yeah, I just felt like you just... You could be feeling stuck because you don't want this person to, you know, not only manipulate you. You don't want this person to put you through what they have put you through. It's like you're trying to, like, get out of Dodge. You know what I'm saying? It's, child, it's like you're trying to get out of the way. You know, you don't want to be stuck on this situation no more. You don't want to go through the same shit anymore with this person. Some of y'all was married to this person. Love affair. The rest of y'all, like I said, because they cheated on you. Love affair don't even have to be marriage. It could just be that they cheated on you. You know, see what I'm saying? You just don't, you don't want to go through that no more. I'm not seeing any feelings in this situation. I'm telling y'all, we got the king of wands. This one to come out so bad. Yeah. Um... <clears throat> Some of y'all, I feel like this person do love you. They do respect you in some way, somehow. But it's like somebody's taking action on this. Somebody's taking action on this. Whether this is you or them. Some of y'all, this, um... That third party could be coming back in a way. I don't know why I'm getting that energy. Maybe they could be approaching your person. I don't know, but because we got karmic love right here, but we're going to clarify. But I am getting that. The only reason why they did, they they was, um they had a sexual encounter with that person. That's probably what, that's what the love affair was. A sexual encounter, but like I said, um, back to what I was saying, you just don't, it's like you're trying to get out of Dodge, like you don't want, you're trying to avoid this person manipulating you and putting you through the same shit again, you see what I'm saying, because they, because they cheated on you, or they left you for somebody else, you see what I'm saying, but somebody is taking leadership in a situation, I feel like it's them, I feel like it's your person. But y'all got y'all, y'all got standards down. Like y'all got y'all boundaries up with this person. You know, you know what it is that you deserve with this King of Wands right here. And you deserve a king. You see what I'm saying? But most of y'all, we got karmic love and we got the Ten of Pentacles. 
I feel like, like I, I knew I was right. Some of y'all, like I said, somebody going to end up running. I don't know what's going on, but the person that they may have had a love affair with, Leo, for some of you guys, not everybody, this person may come back, come back around or pop up or something. And it's because that third party still loved them. But I feel like your person wants to be with you. Some of y'all, your person is a karmic. I am getting that. I'm, I'm reading, I'm trying to read them two different ways because that's what I'm seeing. You know, some of y'all, this person is a karmic love. But some of y'all going to end up taking this person back and giving it another try. You see what I'm saying? Or if not, if they're not, they may have already learned their karmic lesson. And they're willing to come in and give you another try when it comes to love. Because like I am, I am seeing that this person is ready to take leadership and own up to their faults now after stalling to, you know what I'm saying, of not owning up to their faults. They're going to take leadership and own up to their faults and and they want to get back together with you. I, I'm clearly seeing that some of y'all was with this person for a very long time. You see what I'm saying? And um, like I said, they some of y'all this person, yeah, y'all got kids with this person. Whoever I'm talking to. This is somebody you, you you got kids with. You see what I'm saying? And they um they they just felt like they don't want to leave their family. I'm just gonna be honest. Some of y'all this is the breadwinner of y'all relation of in y'all relationship. Maybe they have a really good job. Maybe they do take care of you. And y'all was in separation for a while because they may have left you for somebody else. But like I said, this is somebody that could also be the breadwinner of y'all relationship. They take care of you. You see what I'm saying? And um they ready to get everything back into balance in your relationship the way it was i'm hearing even better because it's like they're ready to change for you i am seeing change though because we do got the hangman reverse and then we got the king of wands you know i just feel like in this situation in this scenario leo y'all just had a hard time trusting this person because they wasn't trying to hold accountability. That was the main thing. They wasn't trying to hold accountability. They kept trying to make it seem like you was the person that was at fault on why they left. But I am seeing a change in perspective with this person and you. Um, because <clears throat> they don't want the other person, for one. And for two, they want their family back, which is you and, the, which is you and your children. I'm going to go ahead and keep on... Um, shuffling but like i said most of y'all gonna end up taking this person back because you do feel like you you got kids with this person i feel like most of y'all are only staying for the children even though you don't have feelings for this person no more most of y'all don't it's you just feel like you have to stay because of finances and y'all children you see what i'm saying we got the six of pentacles yeah this person gonna take care of you i knew i was feeling that energy this person is going to take care of you this person always did take care of you it's just that they was out here doing what the hell they want to do clear and so you don't have to do for nothing this person takes really good care of y'all I'm, I'm clearly seeing that they do they give you what you want it's just that the cheating and it's that's what's in the way or you know what well that was was in the way we got the three of wands. Yeah, I am seeing progression in your relationship. This is coming out. I'm not going to lie, Leo. This energy right here is coming out to be good energy. I didn't expect this. I am seeing progression, though. I am. And you do you you do have your eye out on this person. Like, you're watching this person every move. Even though you live you live with this person and you get back together with this person, you observing because you want to see movement. You want to see progress. You want to see change. Like, you're not playing with this person. Clear intuitive messages, please. But yeah, most of y'all is just it, it is. I am seeing this person is making a change. I'm not seeing any bad behavior. I feel like things is just gonna be slow, very very slow, very slow. Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, it's just gonna. Yeah, it's like y'all gonna be starting from. It's like. It's going to be the same, but it's it's going to be better. But like I said, this person is going to take their time with you. And you taking your time with them. Because like I said, y'all are emotionally closed off completely. Y'all like wrapped out emotionally. Like to the point where y'all, you're going to have to rebuild your bond back up again. And you're going to, you know, you need to, they need to find a way how to get you to love them again. That's how it is with, with you and this person. It's like. You you could be numb to the pain, like numb to what this person has put you through. Most of y'all are numb to this shit, like, 
because this person hurt you so much. They put you through a lot, you know. And um, strength. Yeah, they still holding on. Still, they they still holding on. They do have feelings for you, and you, and like I said, it will get better. So if you, if you felt like the the love was gone in your relationship, Leo, just know that in due time it will get better. It's just extremely slow, and they want to take their time with you, and you want to take your time with them because of what they put you through. You see what I'm saying? And you, you do love this person, but like I said, most of y'all, it, it's like the feelings have, like, you, like, I'm getting numb energy, you know, but it's going to take this person a while to get you to open back up and feel the same way like you used to feel with this person. But I am seeing that you guys are going to give this person another shot because this is somebody you have children with. This is somebody to take good care of you. And this is somebody that you feel like that's worth, you know, holding on to you. To and giving it another shot. You see what I'm saying? Some of y'all may not even have sex with this person yet. Like I said, it's going to be that slow. It's going to be extremely slow. It's like y'all going to be starting all over dating again with this person. That's how much time that you are going to take with this person, Leo. It's like y'all starting from square one. You see what I'm saying? But I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up, Leo. I hope this resonates with you guys. Don't forget to like, comment down below, and subscribe. And I appreciate you guys. Y'all be blessed.